TSC kids. Hey friends, I'm Pastor David Ham, and welcome to Sunday Fun Day. I'm super excited. This is going to be a great day. Oh, wait, did you think I forgot? Because you know what I need you to do. When I say Sunday, you say Fun Day. Sunday, Sunday. Aw, oh, come on. You can do it a little bit louder than that. When I say Sunday, you say Fun Day. Sunday, Sunday. That was amazing. And you're amazing. And I'm so excited. Today, we're talking about something new. Today, we're talking about my happy place. That's right, my happy place. You know, those places that make you smile, those places that make you laugh, those places that make you excited. Well, guess what? Never forget that Jesus is the best happy place ever when you know that he loves you and you know that he cares. But I've got some friends with me today and Zoe's with me today to talk about their happy place. Say hi to Zoe and say hi to my friends for me. Hey TC Kids, I'm so glad we're talking about my happy place. It's important to have a happy place that makes you smile, makes you laugh, and feel excited. There's also a happy place that keeps you safe, and that happy place is with God. Hey, do you have a happy place? My happy place is when I'm dancing and singing. It makes me feel free and express what I feel. Also, the best happy place in the world is when you're talking to God because He's our friend and Heavenly Father. Here's some other kids that want to tell you about their happy place. See you later! My happy place is when I see really, really fast cars. They're fun, powerful, and nice to drive in. When I grow up, I want to make cars just like them and teach people about God. My happy place is Target. I like to shop. That helps me feel better. Luke, what makes you happy? Uh, playing drums. Playing drums? My happy place is the fact that I'm able to get two or three new pet gerbils. My happy place is... The basketball court? Yeah, the basketball court. My own happy place is when Jesus says no more coronavirus and I can go back to Times Square Church and Broadway shows will open. My happy place is my new room upstairs. My happy place is playing outside. My happy place are the library and the soccer field. When I read a good book or play a game, my worries fade away, and instead, I, it brings me happiness and joy. Bye! Hey, TSC kids! Wasn't it so cool to hear about everybody's happy place? Oh, I didn't introduce myself, did I? My name is Mike, and I'm so glad to be here with you today for Sunday Fun Day! Go Sunday, cause that's my fun day! Go Sunday, cause that's my fun! I'm so excited guys. I'm sorry. I'm just so excited to be a part of this series called My Happy Place. And you know, my happy place is when I'm walking in the park or when I'm eating food. Ugh! But my true happy place is found in the joy of the Lord. Oh, you know, this is time for the scripture of the week. And my friend Detective M is here to share it with you. Say hi to Detective M for me. Hey kids, Detective M here, and this week we're going to find out where to find our happy place. Yes, we're on a hunt to find clues to find out where we can find our happy place. Oh, I'm so excited to... Did you hear that? Happy days, and a fun day. We'll be right back. There's something. There's a noise over there. I'm gonna go investigate. I'll be right back. I will see if Detective M knows the truth. Ah! Hello, kids. How are you doing? It's so nice to see you. Ah! Today is Sunday Monday, right? Sunday Monday. We are having fun on this Sunday. I, uh, who am I? I am uh, Detective M. <laughs> Yes, I am Detective M. You see my hat and uh, my, uh, I have a, 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 a thingy thingy to find clues, you know, yes. 
But most importantly, we are going to find out how to find your happy place. Yes, your happy place. Your happy place is not a here and not an in here. No, no, no. Your happy place is in a, a building. Yes, it's in a building, building. Your happy place can be found in uh, toys, in uh, a TV. Yes. Lots of TV, TV shows, TV, TV, TV. Um, your happy place is in the phone, in the iPad, in everything, in material possessions. That is where your happy place is, yes. Someday for... Oh, oh, somebody are coming. Remember, kids, I am a Detective M, right? Detective M, my heart and my thingy thingy for clues. And I tell you the truth. That uh, happy place is not here, happy place is not here. Happy place, somebody come here. Happy place is in material possessions, okay? Hey kids, did you just see somebody that, that looked like me, had my hat, and even a magnifying glass, but it wasn't me, I, I thought I saw, oh, there was somebody that looked like me, but it wasn't me. I know who it was. That was Mr. Imposter. Oh, wow. Mr. Imposter is crafty, he's sneaky, and he always tells lies. I was wondering, I heard that noise and I went to investigate it, but there wasn't anything there. And then I hear a voice out here talking. And I said, wait a minute, who's that voice? It was Mr. Imposter. He's trying to trick you guys. He's trying to tell you that you can find your happy place in material possessions. Was that what he was saying? Did he say, hmm, maybe you can find your happy place in a building? Yes, he did tell you that, didn't he? And maybe he probably even said that you can find your happy place in toys and possessions. He did. Wow. Mr. Imposter is a liar, and the only way that we can fight against lies is with the truth. The truth of God. And where do we find the truth? In the Bible. That's right. The truth is in God's Word. That's going to bring us to the verse of the day. Although Mr. Imposter said those lies, we are going to find out what the verse of the day is, and we're going to find some amazing clues on how to find our happy place and how to fight lies. Today's verse is from Philippians 4, 8, and it says, Finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, Whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue, and if there be any praise, think on these things. Wow! That verse is just full of so many clues. Did you see them? It said, think on these things. So what are we going to think about? We're going to think about things that are true, Things that are honest, things that are just and pure, lovely, of a good report, and virtuous. Wow! God is so awesome. And where do we find these things? We find them all in God, in Jesus and the Holy Spirit, right? And what's an example of doing something positive? Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. <gasps> I can help out my mom or my dad with folding the clothes like Grandma Nona did. I can help out with the laundry. I can help put away the dishes. I can encourage somebody if they're sad. If I see someone who's sad, I can say, God loves you. Remember kids, this week, your happy place is found in God and in Jesus because heaven is your home and God is your father and Jesus is your savior, okay? So remember Philippians 4, 8. Read it, see if you can memorize it, and I'll see you again next week, okay? <laughs> All right, bye-bye, guys. Wow, thanks, Detective M. 
What a great story and a great scripture verse. And thank you so much for helping us understand that we need to watch out for Mr. Imposter. Guess what, kids? It's been a great day, a great Sunday fun day. And next week, we're still going to be talking about My Happy Place and the week after that. Because we really want you to know that My Happy Place can be a lot of places, but the most important happy place is with Jesus because he loves you and he cares. And never forget, God will never leave you and God is fighting for you and God is living where? Inside of you. Hey, TSC kids, it was a great Sunday Monday. I'll see you next week.